What's going on, guys? It's your boy Loki. Like, like, welcome back to the channel. Um, it's currently 7:05 in the morning. Um, just waiting to um, getting ready to go to work. Um, and then later today, I'm going to um, go to go out to eat with my aunt and uncle and my cousins. So that's gonna be fun. Um, but. I also have an update. Um, I got an early birthday present slash, slash graduation present from my grandma, my mima. Just got it from Amazon the other day. It's um, a Ham this Hamilton Beach stand mixer, which is similar to the KitchenAid. Um, I've wanted a KitchenAid for years, but you know, over, over time, you know, you know, over time, I thought I'm spent. I thought that, you know, cool as it is, is it, you know, really worth spending that much money when you could either A, wait for Christmas, or B, I'm going to go in here since I don't want to. Okay. Please excuse that. That's my roommate. Um, I'm sorry if you had to see that. Um, so I would... You know, I could either wait on Christmas, because, you know, I wouldn't want to spend that much on a mixer. Or I can just get something cheaper and similar to it, and I remember she got one just like it. Um, one, uh, one of the versions of it, which doesn't matter which version, I'll be explaining that in the video. Like, I'll be doing a review on stuff on it. Um, but yeah, and she used it for the first time, and I kind of liked it. It was actually kind of cool. You know, I did try, did still try to look for KitchenAids, because I did put that just as an option in case I couldn't afford one hand. I actually came across it while looking at KitchenAids on Amazon, and I thought, you know what, I'll just buy it, since it was actually pretty cheap on Amazon. So yeah, and I actually really like that one. In fact, I honestly might like it even, kind of like it even better than the KitchenAid, just because there's a cool feature on it that I'll show you guys in this vlog and then the review video. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get ready for work. If you're new here, my name is Lil Clay Clay, and I have high-functioning autism. Go ahead and show you guys the mixer since there aren't any interruptions this time. Um, I mean, y'all weren't able to see it anyway, but you could see it better. I would. Um, this is the mixer I was talking about, the Hamilton Beach mixer. My grandma has one of these. She has the one where you can, if you want to, put the utensils in the middle of it right here, and um, use it for like a cheese grater or I think a pasta maker or whatever. I don't really care that mine doesn't have that because now I don't really see the point in that anymore. I mean, I used to like it when I was young. I thought it was cool, but now, like, you know, I could, why would you want to drag your mixer out when you just use, like, a food processor or something? But, yeah, um, it's still pretty cool. I literally plugged this in just to see how it sounded. I'm that weird. I'm that weird, you guys. But, yeah, what's cool about it is it has these suction cups that help it stay on the ground when you on the counter for when you're using it um yeah so i that's i think comes in really handy in case um you uh, you uh turn it on really, turn it on to the high speed and it starts shaking it doesn't the ball starts to shake but this doesn't move around um oh it's cool is i think that's one thing that the kitchen aids don't have but yeah this is a as good as kitchen aid i will be doing a review on this mixer so I'm at work right now. Um, I thought my I thought Joey Joey was here. I don't think it's him. I thought I saw his Volkswagen Jetta at all, which is one of the few that were our stick shift. But um, I guess it wasn't. Up. Is that him texting me? <laughs> his Jetta is here, but he is not. Yeah. Nothing really has changed at work. I've uh, been so strawberry here. Um, and then, um, let me take this and toboggan home and wash it. Um, yeah, I just, other than I recently got this mobile charger, and I have one at home and, and I have one at work. My grandma, my mima gave this to me because it wouldn't work on her LG yet. Yes, you heard me, LG. No, because unfortunately, Verizon will never have an iPhone for some reason. But yeah, um, 
hopefully today should go smooth. I know I need to weed eat and stuff, but yeah. So, I actually got another SD card to use for my JVC. Let's see if I can show you guys. And it should be coming in today. Hopefully it'll come before my aunt and uncle pick me up. I'm still gonna keep my handy cam. This is still a good camera. I just wish the only problem I've had with it is it's been having an issue with the SD card lately. Um, which stings. If I had known, I wouldn't have got it. I remember looking at this camera. I wanted something like this. <coughs> with the <coughs> fancy camcorder. I mean, I could have got something cheaper, but I chose this. Um, you know, I don't regret buying it. Because it still is a good camera. I'll still keep it for a backup. I still sometimes use it just if I feel like I don't need to take my JVC. But yeah, I'm excited. So I just finished what well, went to weed eating to mowing. Um, what I did was I just got in the mower, got it sitting over there, and um, I improvised and got some of the spots I could also get with the mower because Luke wanted me to try to weed eat some of the spots that I supposed to could and got with the mower and I tried that but the battery on that do well that's the only issue with these battery powered weed eaters they didn't last long so I thought instead of just like switching it all day I'll just mow the weed eating spots that I can with the mower which went well I mean I did pop the transmission and this mower is hard to start because it is a clutch but you know I'm not complaining I actually had a little fun with it since I've never really driven a mower like that before. I've driven zero turns all my life. <laughs> but yeah. So it's out for delivery. Estimated arrival time is uh, 3 to 6 p.m. I do hope it comes before 6 because that's when my uncle is picking me up. He might be a bit early. I just would like to go ahead and try to use it. Um, like I said, you know, I turned this camera on and started doing the recovering data thing. I'm not complaining about that, but it's just driving me crazy. Um, so I want to go ahead and use, I don't want to have to go through that when I'm trying to vlog with my family. Forgot to say that we're getting Subway for lunch today. Hopefully they bring it before my Uber comes because my Uber's not going to be here. My Uber's not going to be here till one, but like I don't want to fight with the Uber person. I don't want to upset them. I mean, they, I'm sure they'd understand. I'm sure they would let me eat my food in the car, but I don't want to um, upset them. Because, you know, they do have their jobs are hard because they're having, because I don't, because I you know, they're peep, complete strangers in their vehicles. I'm going to drive them around. They don't know what they're going to do. I don't know if there's somebody who wants to hurt them. But yeah. Look what we got here. This guy's already trying to be a whiny baby. Oh, what a whiny baby. All his DVUs. And we got these guys over here. Yeah. Don't be videotaping. You gotta give me uh, royalties, dude. I ain't giving you no royalties, royalties. fool. You didn't support. You need. Yeah. You need it. I only get royalties. Yeah. I yeah, need. Wait till they see me on there. They're gonna be like, man, you gotta get that guy's autograph. You wanna record? You gotta pay. Bro, you didn't even give me no support, though. I only give my audience people who support me. Like Mike and Christian. So this guy's giving me probably like gonna give me more views. Yeah. Yeah. This guy's a pacifist. <laughs> I am a pacifist. <laughs> Here's mine. Whichever one oh gosh, you got, got subway. Subway. One of them does. Look at the end. I've seen it. Got Subway. Yeah. You see? It's just vegetables. Are you dancing, Marjay? Well, I think yours is the I only one. For vegetables. Let her dance. Let her dance for the camera. Yeah. Like, why is she dancing? The ones on. So, see y'all later. My Uber driver has been out there since 12:40. He didn't tell you. He was early. The thing didn't tell me. Oh. It got it all mixed up. In the Uber app, got it all mixed up. That's crazy. But anyway, I'm about to go check out, clock out for the day, and then go meet him. See y'all later. See you, buddy. <laughs> yeah. Um, so I'm gonna 
Look for the grey equinox. Equinox, equinox, equinox. Um, I'm gonna see. Where did he say he was? Uh, that's him right there. Walk ceiling. Assume that's him. See what he's doing. Here he comes, pulling right into me. Um, let's see. Let me get the number out on the Uber app. How you doing? This is the number? Okay. Yep, just wanted to tell you the number. Okay. Yeah, I don't know if I had to tell you or if you had to see it or... No. Yeah. <laughs> and you do need a mask if you've got one. All right. Okay. Thank you. So I just got home. Uber driver was a real nice guy. It's kind of funny. I put in the address wrong again. <laughs> I struggle with that, I mean, because, you know, they can't really see our location um, fully yet. Um, look at my yard, y'all. Me and my papa needs to mow it. I need to go get my rabbit span. Anyway, I'm just going to go in the house and take a nice shower, nice hot shower, and then get ready to go tonight. And, uh, waiting, and, uh, huh, I see they got, huh, I see, oh, what's this? Trash, not picking that up. <laughs> but, yeah, get ready to go. Go ahead and show you guys the mixer, since there aren't any interruptions this time. Um, I mean, y'all weren't able to see it anyway, but you could see it better. I would um... This is the mixer I was talking about, the Hamilton Beach mixer. My grandma has one of these. She has the one where you can, if you want to, put the utensils in the middle of it right here. And um, use it for like a cheese grater or I think a pasta maker or whatever. I don't really care that mine doesn't have that because now I don't really see the point in that anymore. I mean, I used to like it when I was young. I thought it was cool, but now like, you know, I could... Why would you want to drag your mixer out when you just use like a food processor or something? But yeah, um, it's still pretty cool. I literally plugged this in just to see how it sounded. I'm that weird. I'm that weird, you guys. But yeah, what's cool about it is it has these suction cups that help it stay on the ground when you on the counter for when you're using it. Um, yeah, so I, that's, I think comes in really handy in case um you uh, you uh, turn it on really. Turn it on to the high speed and it starts shaking. It doesn't, the ball starts to shake, but this doesn't move around. Um, oh, it's cool. I think that's one thing that the KitchenAids don't have. But yeah, this is a, as good as KitchenAid. I will be doing a review on this mixer. So, guys, as you can see, oh, it's a touch screen. Oh, it's so cool with the touch screen. Um, today we are. That can mean the official time where I use my JVC to record videos. Um, I just it just came in. The card just came in. I need to change the address because I had it changed at my grandmother's one time for some reason. I can't remember why, but I can't remember why. Oh, it gives me the notification. Here we go. Yeah, I need to change it. I have to go through that again. Really don't like having to walk down to my announcing from Clayton's second echo show. From Clayton's second echo show. Dinner is ready. <laughs> um from um my <laughs> grandparents' driveway just because it's hard to walk down um 
sometimes they'll leave. I used to think they would leave in there because sometimes they'll confuse their address. But yeah, I need to change it to my grandma's address. I can't remember why I had it on there. But yeah, I'm now recording with my JVC. I'll still keep this Sony handy camera as a backup. It's still a good camera. Um, yeah, for I guess if I'm going somewhere, maybe I just don't feel like dragging my big one around. But yeah, I'm excited to start videos with this camera. So we are now going to the Mexican restaurant. I got my uncle with me. I got my aunt and Catherine. I remember Harper and Hudson. Hi. Harper has a YouTube channel. I'll be sure to put a link to it in the description. Subscribe and show her some love. Um, so we got us some sun rain, what I like to call what I like to call it. Going down to the Rio Grande. Get some food. This Toyota Tacoma. The boss stereo system. Mexican restaurant and I went to their food. Got me a whole bunch of food. This little guy's like me, he got the cheese quesadilla. It's all I would order when I was little. Yeah, the cheese dip. Cheese dip, I got the regular. <laughs> Left the Mexican restaurant and we're going to Harris Teeter. Pick, pick me some to eat. Yay! Some dessert. It's dessert time. <laughs> yeah. 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 Get some Got dessert. Some dessert. Yeah. Dumb. Yep. Cheese. Cheese. Don't eat this cake. Got a collar. So we are back at the house. Um, where I am, my brother's here. Um, they dropped me off at a fun time before, after we left the Rio Grande. Uh, it was kind of funny because this one wait waitress was rude to us. Like she just walked off when, because Hudson he ordered a case of dip, but he didn't get his. And like I think she had the meals all confused, which is fine. But, like she's like, all of a sudden just walked off and like. Like, okay, I'll be right back and just walked off. I mean, I get it. Sorry about that, y'all. <laughs> um, you, um, you're stressed and you know, all of a sudden you really just screwed up. There's no reason to act that way. But anyway, we after that, we went to Harris Teeter and they got me a whole bunch of stuff. They got me some Kit Kat Thins, Hershey's Hugs. Ooh, I love these. And I got some combos. Harris Teeter gummy worms. I wanted to get the trolls. They didn't have any. These got life service gummies. Um, let me show you what else we got. It's more than what that came from. Um, let's see. Got me some root beer. Let me turn the light. Let me turn my light on so y'all can see. Let me see if this camera light should work. Oh. Yeah, I don't work too well. So 
Sorry, I'm trying to. This camera light don't work too well. Turn this on. So y'all can see a bit better. Got some Gatorade, root beer, and she got me some. Also got me some strawberry marshmallow swirl ice cream and some of these things called mochi mochis. Pretty cool, these Japanese flavored ice creams. Hopefully, got the freezer turned up enough. I can't turn this fridge up too high because if I do, it'll freeze the other stuff too. See so if you don't want that. And I got some more root beer, some Gatorade, um, Japanese sodas. I got some monster drinks too, which y'all can barely see there. And then we got the ultimate. Got me some powdered donuts. Really soft cookies. I'm addicted to these. These are really good. Um, frosted sugar cookies. I gotta learn how to make these. I wanna learn how to make my own. Then I got, I got some Hershey's Chips Ahoy. Then it's uh, and then I also got. See, I got some Chips Deluxe uh, Family Rainbow size, which I hopefully did not just squish. <laughs> yeah, I was. I didn't even know they were going to do that. Um, they also got me a card with money in it. Not going to say how much in case you'll try to steal me. And then, of course, I got these at the Mexican restaurant as well. I went to the Rio Grande, where I used to, near the area I used to go to church to, at my old church. That's where we went. I didn't even know they were going to do that. You know, I'm very happy that we got to do this. Um, but anyway, guys. I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Um, don't forget to be looking out for more. Um, I also have a update on my fish Frankie. I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick. Let's see if the focus, if I can fix the focus real quick. Any minute now. Come on, focus. Don't do this. You're not. Okay, so let me try this. Let's see what this does. Sorry, I'm trying to fix it. Here we go. I see Frankie right there. I'm gonna call him Frankie. I'm gonna get some more fish. I got, I got him one of those little scrubbing things right there for Amazon. And I also got a thing that's supposed to either suck the water out or clean the little rocks because you can see they have algae that's been on there for a while. I just wanted to find him something that I could clean his tank with without having to take him out of the tank. You know, because I don't have anything to put him in there, and I don't want to, like, forget about him. But, yeah. Anyway, guys. Go ahead and end the vlog. Um, hope y'all enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.